Okay, I was on the other side of this road last week and there's the public school there, Auburn Public School, and I was crossing the road saying, last week I was saying, it's probably hard to hear it last week. I don't know if you could hear me last week very well and the volume could, volume, sorry for the volume, it's not as good as it should be. So, um, I'm walking down here. Yeah, I'm not the lights. Remember I was gonna ask that guy here? See, these people got no clue. There's a few people that do, that have lived here a long time. Um, and that, that are from different backgrounds and have lived here for a long time. So it's a few different, uh, lots of different nationalities. Um, I'd probably find some Australian people here, I'm sure, that are in there, you know, like, like um, younger or older generation, probably down there. That, I don't know. It'd be nice to know. Um, but this is where I am right now. Now I can cross the road. This is how they do it here. comes up I'm sure it's the same everywhere else but you haven't got much time as soon as that little green man disappears and goes to red you can't stop in the middle of the road you carry on <laughs> um, I did I was in Melbourne many years ago and I crossed the road without um, without the signals going off and I just walked past you know just walked through um, it was only a little little street and a policeman stopped me and he said um, no, I can, uh, you can be uh, fined for doing that. Jaywalking. Oh, I said, oh, okay. And he said, go back and cross, cross again. Okay then, so I crossed again. <laughs> so I could have been fined for jaywalking. And that's many years ago anyway, it's not, not now. So that's the past. So last week I walked past all this. See, where's that? I think it's another school. Could be. A, so it's part of the public school, yeah. So it's pretty big. Auburn Public School here. Yeah. Now I have to say um, uh, a couple of things in a minute. So let me just show you. This is where I am now. This is exactly where I am now. Yeah. Oh, okay. So this is where I am now. And uh, actually, it's very close again very close so uh, let me just put this phone down for a moment and just think what am I gonna say here <laughs> okay here we go Nobody home. Uh, any 
anyone home? Is anyone home there? A anyone home? Uh, okay, thank you. I don't have the phone number. I don't have a phone number. Are you neighbour here? No, 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 no. Uh, what? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. No home. No home. No. No. It's okay. Uh, renovation. Renovating. Huh? Renovating. Look like renovating. Yeah. Fixing the home. Fixing. Fixing home. The home. Yeah, they're fixing the home. Looks like fixing the home now. Yeah, here we go. Fixing the home. Yeah. That's really the one. See? And then, here we go. Next door. Next door neighbours. Hello. Oh, hello. How are you? Good, how are you? Yeah, I've lived here a long time. Uh, who, who are you? Uh, my name is Sunny. Um, I'm, I'm actually uh, living in Sydney. Yes. And uh, I've come to ask about uh, the house, I think, here. Love Thy Neighbour. Do you know the TV show? TV From, show? Yes. Uh, uh, Love Thy Neighbour. It's an English TV show. I think they filmed it in this street here and I just came to visit say hello and that's it. <laughs> hello. Uh, hello. Yeah. Mm. So I'm not sure if it's this house or the house next one where they made the filming and it's a famous house. Yeah. So uh, that's all I want to say. Okay. Yeah. I've got to say hello. Yeah. Hello. So um, do you know that show, Love Thy Neighbour? Uh, 
I love my neighbour. Yeah, it was it was shown in 1980. Uh, in I heard about it. I heard about it. You heard? Yes, yeah, ah, I heard about it. Yeah, yeah. Yes. They showed that one in yes. Channel Seven. On Channel Seven. And, and they filmed. I feel. I think they filmed it next door. Two houses down. Down there. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. 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 So, is this this one here? I think so, isn't yeah, it? Yeah. Yeah. That's this one. Yeah. He's yeah. renovating. Looks like they're fixing the house. Yeah, they're fixing the houses. <laughs> Yeah, yes. alright then. I thought I'd just come by and say hello. Okay, I'll say hello. Yeah. Right. Have a great day. Okay, you See too. Bye-bye. 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 Thank you. Bye-bye. No worries. <laughs> no worries. <laughs> Well, that's it, isn't it? So it turns out, it turns out then, the guy seems to be the same nationality as me and uh, he hasn't lived in that house for very long. What about that, hey? What about that? Isn't that, I'll tell you what. 
uh, if you want to talk about coincidences, I don't know what is. I really don't know what is. So that's it. That is it. Right there. It's okay. It's okay for me to, to go there. Because I think I know today, today just seems like closer to home in two ways. Strange. Closer to home in two ways. UK TV. Uh, meaning love thy neighbour. Uh, and, you know, of it, that being filmed here, so I came over, and the person turned out to be, turns out to be Turkish. What about that? And he hasn't been here long, so he's decided, I'm going to renovate the property. He's probably got a bit of money renovating the property. Good on him. Good. That's okay. That's okay. I'm not saying anything bad about that. But um, I, I, was, <laughs> I was a bit... Um, I had my thoughts at first, thinking, oh, this is not going to be good. You know, uh, me going to someone's home and, and they'll probably turn up to the door and say, what are you doing on my property or something like that. I was a bit, you know, what's the word, sceptical or something. Or, you know, but these people turned out to be really nice. And even the next door neighbours, next door neighbours, which both are Lebanese, uh, seem to uh, welcome me a little bit. Um, so if I pop over again, I can probably show you on the insides. So they're probably renovating. I could show you uh, the insides, uh, the living room, if, it's, if that's really okay with the owner. But I've got to find out first if that's okay. Because I wouldn't want to be um, uh, invading someone's privacy, something like that. But, uh, but there it is. Uh, I think the owner knows and uh, the other um, owners, neighbours know as well. Uh, there's another um, neighbour on the other side next door is Vietnamese but I don't think she, she probably doesn't know but she knows of the person next door. There it is. I was there. That's it. I, and how many times I walked past that property I don't know. Looking for 101, and it's not even 101. And, I, and I'm just showing you there. Fair Dinkum, mate, or fair and square, exactly where it was recorded. So um, it's look. This is a it's a first. It's a first time thing for me. Um, and I thought I'll do it first. So I don't recommend anyone, you know, just turning up at people's doorstep and, you know, like I just did. It's, it's, you know, sometimes not a good thing, but you have to express yourself in a way that, um, explain why you're there. Um, how come you turned out to be here and, um, and the reason why you're there. Like not, not don't say things like, I want to come inside, blah, blah, blah. You can't, nah. You can't do that, that's ridiculous. Uh, so I, I had a reason to go there and it's because um, I'm a long time fan of Love Thy Neighbour. Even though, as I said, even though I said at the, earlier on in the show, I had a big break of not watching it for so many years. Even though I really loved that show when I was young, I hadn't watched it for so many years. This is the first time this week, this is the first time this week, I'm just telling you now, uh, first time this week I've watched it in uh, in, a le in a length of time, you know, in some length of time which, uh, for hours. I've never watched it like that for hours for a long time because it's um, available to you now. Like you can buy DVD and things like that. So um, that's something, you know, down the track you can look at, you know. Um, if you If your sons or daughters want to buy their parents a Love Thy Neighbour box set, DVD or the Love Thy Neighbour in Australia box set DVD look watch this because um, I'm going to take you through to the uh, details of what there is available there and um, there's some really good stuff out there and remastered and everything but anyway um, the thing I was going to say to you is Robert Hughes on that TV show he's Robert Hughes is a very a very famous um, Australian um, actor, comedian here, more of a comedian, I'd say, 
because he was on a TV show called Hey Dad. I mentioned it in the other episode. He is funny. He's so funny on this show. He, he acts as if he's, um, he's married on this show and he lives in that house. And, and um, well, he doesn't live in that house. It's just on the episodes. <laughs> That's what was recorded. He, he, he was married on the show and um, as, as you know, Eddie Booth came to Australia and he uh, lived in with them. And he makes, you know, he makes out as if he's, you know, a bit of a doesn't know anything person. And some of the words he comes out with, you just, he can say one word and you start bursting out laughing. He'll say one word and that's it. It is, it is so funny on that. So it makes it funny when his wife says some, um, uh, some things that just make you laugh in a way like uh, the youth that Joyce did on Georgia Mildred. So that was quite funny, you know, she was funny again. And then, then you've got uh, the Robert Hughes from Hey Dad, who was so funny, he's the husband that just doesn't know much at all. And you've got this real Aussie guy that um, Eddie Booth works with. Um, I won't tell you too much about that, you've got to watch it. And he's a real Aussie, you know, Bruce. Uh, I'm all right, mate, and yeah, that, that type of person. And um, and then you've got Eddie living in the house. He is, he is one of the best uh, um, shows I've seen, and this is the first time I've this is the first time I've seen it. One of the best uh, comedy Australian comedies I've seen for a long, long time because I used to watch Paul Hogan series in the UK, and that was that was just as funny. Yeah, you know, we all loved Benny Hill show and Paul Hogan show. So I loved them both, you know. Still like Paul Hogan, he's still great, you know. But um, this show, this this week, just watching them, wow, it is one of, the, it just makes you laugh. If you want something to make you laugh, and it will, uh, you've got to watch a show. It's um, full of the English humour, and you've got Aussie humour, so you've got a mix of both. It's, it's, um, what a treasure that is. And to see that house down there, um, uh, and <laughs> it makes you want to, all oh, right, I'm in Auburn. I'm in Auburn, yeah. It makes you want to kind of put down the carpet and go, oh, this is where he was. <laughs> yeah, like, uh, this is where Jack Smithers was. Okay, look, one more time, just take you through it one more time and just have a quick talk. Um, and yeah, it's, you can see it behind me. You'll see it behind me in a minute. <laughs> um, I understand. So this is something else I found out this week. So I'm finding out these things slowly and it's like, uh, every, so every time, every kind of step you take so slow and, um, you know, you, every now and again, you look at the internet to find out a little bit more. Oh, what about this? You think about it and then you go straight to the internet. And um, I, I've, of course, I know that he's had some children uh, to his wife, Jack Smithhurst. And I found out um, uh, one of the uh, one of his son is an actor. Hello, hello, Adam, if you're watching, Adam Smithhurst. I didn't even know. Look, I didn't even know these things. If any, if you're watching this, or any of um, Adam's friends watching this, hello, Adam. I've just been doing this thing. Uh, it's a tribute to your dad and love thy neighbor because uh it's it's something i wanted to do it's just something i wanted to do and um it's i find it interesting uh, uh look i'm i'm here now i'm here to, here at the house again and i think the owner might be here so let's have a look if the owner is here and he's okay with me maybe we can say hello to him <laughs> let's see Yeah, so I thought I'd walk the streets of Auburn and show you uh, this this place where um, uh, your dad did some recording on, on right on this road here and just at the property here in the grey, uh, the, the building I just showed you. Um, so without um, invading someone's privacy, I don't really want to do that. So, you know, maybe I'll come and say hello again one day and uh, yeah, just put it on the, just put it on the show. <laughs> but 
but yeah hello Adam and anyone else that's watching from all over the world um, that's it that's that's the show that's that's the show love thy neighbor in Australia only seven episodes um, that's what I've been doing this week just watching them and laughing my head off you got to laugh your head off that's there's nothing nothing <laughs> I must have been laughing my head off and I hope everyone else heard down the street because it's so funny you got to laugh it's the best medicine you can ever have um, and don't tell I don't I don't want anyone to say you're not allowed to laugh it's a load of bullshit uh, so that's uh, it's just around the corner from the house <laughs> so that's that's it love thy neighbor in Australia um, other things I got to see and do was uh, look up Robert Hughes and uh, find out a little bit, a little bit about him because I used to watch Hey Dad as well and that was a funny show that was quite funny so when I arrived here in the late 80s um, used to watch those type of shows as well Aussie shows quite good similar humor funny um, but when you watch this it's just the seven episodes about 20 something minutes each um, it's it's like double the humor and um, you got you got an Aussie and English guy firing off at each other saying you pommy pufta you Aussie uh, git or something like that um, and it's not like um, you know yeah it's different it's not like the you know the racial slurs you hear like you know like you did on the first one uh, but fun, this is funny again but in a different way and but in a good way in a good way and, and funny so um, don't just watch a few minutes and leave it watch it and then you'll get into it a little bit more so it takes a little while to get in watch it and understand and see what's going on it's funny um, I could take you through the episodes talk to them talk to you about them bit by bit but it's gonna probably bore the hell out of you so I don't want to bore the hell out of you and make you sleep uh, whilst you're watching this you're probably falling no don't fall asleep now <laughs> um, so this is a I'd say you could say this is a best, better episode than the first set because I found I actually found the property um, I'm, I've watched the episodes I know I do know more about um, uh, some of the episodes now and that the first set of episodes in the UK contained about 50 53 to 56 episodes or something like that so quite a lot of episodes uh, in the UK because I remember them one after the other uh, it's like it's something that we just didn't get away from when it was on it was on we watched it and it was fun uh, same like Georgia Mildred and all the other ones I may have mentioned before but uh, yeah that's that's it um, now we're going to, we, we'll just go to the next section of the video I'll take you away from here now Auburn this is it now I've had my kebab <laughs> I've had my kebab I found the home that I was meant to see and uh, now we're gonna look at um, uh, the, the DVDs because uh, if like I said if you really want to get them uh, this is the place you can have a look we can search them together um, I'm sure this is the first I, I really am sure you know someone doesn't rock up at someone's house and go hey. <laughs> but I didn't do it yet I didn't do it yet and um, if someone's just arrived home you just don't walk in there and uh, I don't want to do that that's why I said I'll come back again uh, another stage drive all the way from God knows wherever and then uh, come back and uh, continue on with the show if you guys want me to do it continue on with the show and you know talk to the owner and things like that I can but um, you got to be cautious about these things you know today people don't want you to enter any no, like no one wants somebody else to enter anyone's home but um, you know I can show you the differences as I said but it really depends on the person that and that's it's something you don't really want to do is um, you know it's something you don't want to do like go to someone's home oh look I'm gonna do this and this uh, recording your property uh, can I do this no, no we don't we don't go there so um, yeah, that's it for a nice afternoon uh, and um, 
relaxing a little bit, have, having something to eat and thinking about what I want to say. And I didn't get to say it in the end, but I did. I actually did get to say it at um, his neighbour's uh, houses to, just to say that I'm here for a reason um, and that uh, they filmed down here in 1980 a famous TV show and they did and I, I was just uh, explaining that to the neighbours so they do know of the show uh, one of them's got a very good idea the other one kind of and I didn't want to shove the uh, video in their face because it's not a good thing you know um, so um, let's look at this another time or just leave it as it is because it's good memories and move on hope you enjoyed that good fun Great deal easier, life will be free.